Greetings and welcome back to Eco. I'm Catherine O'Sky and I'm just finishing collecting um, a tree that I just chopped down, an oak tree just that's uh, sort of northeast from my base. I, I'm going to say that everything <laughs> revolves around my base, so I'm just going to think about the base and how I uh, refer to it as when I'm looking toward the mountain. Um, I'll show you in just a second, and that's how I'll talk about things if you want to keep a closer eye on, on uh, how I'm doing. Anyway, so yeah, this is what we're going to say is south, looking south toward the ocean, even though the globe doesn't make much sense because it kind of rotates around. <laughs> Um, but yeah, north will be this direction, um, and then east is to the right, where the sun is rising, and uh, west is the other direction. So we'll have an Earth-like planet, though we do not know if this is exactly like Earth, um, but it certainly has some similar qualities. Let's finish collecting this wood, um, and I thought that we might go hunting today. Now, I'm not taking the cart because the terrain here is kind of iffy. So I'm just, oh, oh, there's our, oh, a bush, a new bush. Hooray. That's a huckleberry bush that um, is growing for us. Oops, I need uh, more food. And I really need to get a better diet because this one doesn't have any proteins in this. So maybe we can cook something that does. Let's go check and see if any of the recipes that we can cook right now has any protein. We might just get some meat. Um, Campfire beans we can't make. Charred beets. Beets have protein. We don't have any beets. <laughs> oh, commas bulbs do though. Let's make like uh, five of those. What about corn? Probably not. Oh, it does have protein. That's a surprise to me. Um, right, let's make uh, maybe like 30 of those. Cool. And we have a lot of skill points to spend uh, and after we get this tree back, or the logs back, let's check on and see if any of our research books are completed yet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We have an opportunity. Okay, so this is how hunting works. You draw your bow uh, and hope you hit something. I was hoping to hit that uh, turkey, but I don't think I did. There it is. Ah, it's running now. Okay. I would really ideally like to get um, some more skill points in um, in hunting. Now, there's a reason KOS does not play first-person shooter games. <laughs> oh, is this, like, not going to let me pick it up because I'm approaching it from the wrong side? Because I need to chop it, and it's not letting me chop. Yo. Too large. But I can't pick it up, can I? I keep chopping, but it's, um, that's really strange. Okay. Well, it's not going to let me pick it up right now. So we'll just leave it there and we'll just go back to camp or back to our house. Where's our house? It's over here. Okay, cool. Yes. Our stockpiles are getting large. <laughs> now you know why I left two spaces here. <laughs> um, yeah. And space to walk around is always good. So, uh, right. I want to look and see how our research is going. Cause, oh, wow. We got some skill books completed. Excellent. So this one is still missing four mortared stone. Uh, looks like we got some other things done though. I'm very excited about this. Okay. So what happens when you finish research is that you get your skill books and, uh, you can leave them. Let's see. How many do we have? We have a bunch. We have several. This is very cool. Uh, and some of these things are getting mixed where they shouldn't. Oh, there's my torch. I got a torch to walk around at night. Um, okay, there we go. Seeds are there. This is, ooh, this is food. Right. So I'm going to get some, eat some stuff here. Yeah, and we're getting more skill per day once we have a more balanced diet. Because right now it's very heavy on vitamins and carbs. Uh, so we're not getting a good balance multiplier, unfortunately, but hopefully we're going to get better, better food soon. Anyway, uh, is that the last of the skill books? Looks like it is great. Okay. So when you get a skill book and this is very cool for multiplayer, uh, you can right click it 
and it generates a scroll. Uh, and that teaches you the relevant skill. So if we go to our skills thingy for, what does this teach us? Smelting. So that is under masonry, right? Is it, where is it? I don't know where it is. Smith. Advanced smelting. Okay. It even says smelting, not researched. Okay. So when you right click this, it should give us, there it is, smelting. Uh, and the neat thing is that we'll look at this later is that you can, these, these things don't go away. They stay in, in your inventory or colony inventory, and you can generate as many scrolls as you want. I'm not going to do that because see, I don't think there's a way to delete them. I haven't found a way, any way to like burn stuff or trash stuff in this game. So I'm just going to click one of each, but you can generate as many as you want. Okay. We've also learned advanced campfire cooking and wood construction, which is great. Uh, so we're going to put our scroll or our skill books in one of these chests inside. We might move it like upstairs or somewhere else where it's out of the way uh, at some point, but this is good. Uh, we now have the ability to do more stuff. Uh, so let's just do that. Smelting, right? Let's uh, figure out how to do this. There we go. We can do basic smelting efficiency. Okay. We want to get at least iron ingots. We need level two. That costs us a lot of points to get this. Metalworking, uh, we can do the iron axe, pickaxe, uh, tallow wall lamp. Let's see, mint recipe, mint, really? Oh, mint, like, <laughs> I kept thinking mint the plant, but it's not. Um, at the moment, we don't need any of these items. We're gonna leave those skill points for now. But we are going to get some of basic smelting efficiency so we can use some of our uh, resources more efficiently. Uh, what else did we get? Hunters. I want to learn hunter specialty. So kind of, let's see the damage thing. Bow damage. Yes. And what is this? Oh, predatory instincts. It increases how close you can approach animals. Okay. And there's fishing. So we unlock, we need to get level three for the fish trap. Oh, we don't have enough skill points. Darn it. All right, let's get hunting first. What is this? This is increasing damage. There we go. Okay, that's fine. We'll get fishing or actually we'll get predatory instincts for now. And we'll go hunting today. Uh, can we build the smelter yet? The bloomery, that's what we really want here. We need 40 boards and more sand we only want one of these. So let's go and make 40 boards here. Okay. We need, uh, 20. Actually, let's make 40. Let's just make, or make, you know, make 60. So we make 120 cause we're going to need them for other constructions. Uh, so we might as well do it. Okay, cool. And Ooh, we could make this, we could make a tailoring table. Uh, let's do that. And the butchery table, we can't do it. We need woodworking three. Do we have that? Woodworking. Oh, it's wood construction. We have, yeah, we have, we have points. <laughs> Hewn log, log construction. And then there's lumber construction. Um, wait, woodworking. Th what is woodworking three? Hold on. Hewing, hewn log processing. Oh, here's woodworking. Oh, okay. There we go. One. Oh, we almost had it. Almost. Okay. We don't have it. We need more skill points. Let's go hunt stuff. Oh, hello. We're going to hunt you right now. Oh, okay. Two shots. Oh no. Oh my God. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> oh, hi. Oh God. Didn't see it initially. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on over. There we go. Okay, we got a turkey. Uh, I forgot to check uh, in our research thing. Now, the bigger animals are obviously easier to hit, and I have successfully hunted all the animals so far. Even though it takes me a while, like I said, KOS is not an expert at FBS. Um, but that's okay. We're okay. We're going to be just fine. Let us check at the research table what we need here. We need... Bison carcass, one, three elk, and three hares. Okay, so one, three, three on those items. 
I want to put away some stuff so that we can carry the maximum amount of uh, things back. Okay, here is... Um, yeah, and we're just going to store this, this turkey for now until we get a butchery table. Uh, let's also take our arrows. Oh, and we have lots of plot markers too. I'm, I think I'm going to leave the plot markers at home somewhere, like here. Because we don't really need them at the moment. We don't actually need them at all, I think, because... Uh, we have no, this is a single player game, so we have really no competition or anything like that. So we're going to go and hunt stuff. We need bison, three hares, and some elk. There's a hare. There we go. Okay, we've got the hare down in one, one hit. One hit, one kill, meow. <laughs> Jesus. Or one shot, one kill. I don't know what the thing is, what they say. They say something along those lines. Mm -hmm. Yes. Pro FPS cat, right? Meow. Okay. Let's see if we can find a bison. There's one. Now, these are going to take a number of shots. So just be prepared and hopefully shoot it enough times. Come on, run, run, run. Run, girly, run. Oh. They do run a lot. Okay. Excuse me. There we go. Okay, we got the bison. It's so sad to kind of kill these animals, um, but it is required for progression in the world. It's a thing. Okay, what else do we want to hunt? We need some elk. Let's go to an elk zone. Let's see if we can uh, find some. I know there was some somewhere. I seen, I've seen some. Oh, there's some right here. Actually, let's go up there then. And... Uh, oh. We're just going to kill what we can because we're going to need more more animals for other uh, uh, unlocks. Oh, geez. Where did it go? There it is. Okay. There's a lot of bushes here. Wow, a lot of them are dying too. Come on. Don't struggle. Let me kill you dead. Sorry. Sorry to kill you. Okay. Um, what, <laughs> you might be mindful that once you start going and... Are there berries on this bush? No, no, no. Wrong bush. Uh, once you start kind of going through an area, you will scare a bunch of animals. You really will. So you have to be kind of careful about how you approach them. There's another hare. Excellent. Did it? Oh, there it goes. Okay. I was like, no, I don't want to lose that. Because hares, hares are probably the most difficult. They're a tiny target. Oopsie, there's a wolf over there. Did it? There it is. Oh my god. Whoops. Oh, these run fast, don't they? Good lord. Did I hit it? I don't know where it went. Oh well. Oh, there's a turkey. And once you've knocked the arrow into the bow, you cannot take it out. So <laughs> it's kind of a funky thing. So you kind of almost have to shoot it. You have to waste an arrow if you pull the bow back or the bow string back. And, uh, oh, 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 come on. Oh, there it is. God, it's so hard to see in all this grass. Okay, that one. There we go. We got one. However, I have not seen any elk yet. Uh, it is worth noting that different animals have different types of um, fur or hair. And some of them will give you leather and some will give you... Uh, fur or fuzzy stuff and you will need those to unlock the tailoring um, skill book I think it's a skill book okay there's supposed to be elk around here all over the place hello elk are you here there's a fox 
Oopsies. No. Okay. Let me just move the map. Maybe down here. I remember seeing a, a large concentration down there. Let's go that way instead. I think that fox is too fast. I might need to get more damage. Let's see if I can get more damage on hunting. Is this predatory instincts? No damages. <laughs> yeah. Okay, bow efficiency, I think it's probably um, stamina per shot, I'm guessing. God, how can I cross this? Oh, we can swim up the waterfall. That's what we're going to do here. This is such a, a funky procedure, but I'm amused. Come on, can I get up? There we go. Excellent. Go over this mountain. Excuse me. Okay. Ooh, there's a bison. Do we want to get the bison? Yeah, I might as well, I suppose. I'm not going to shoot the turtles, though. I haven't seen that there's any use for shooting turtles, so we're not. We're going to be interested in using what we need and not... Oh, not enough room in inventory. Okay, so this is something that you will find... Um, is that once you're you're carrying too much stuff? Ooh, let me put a marker down. I'm gonna put drop away point. Um, okay. Some bison. Okay. Yeah, once you're carrying too much stuff, and I have I'm carrying two bison on me. I am just <laughs> like a muscle van over here. Um, yeah, you can't carry any more. That's one of the the skill points that you can level up in I think it's the survivalist there it is it's up here strong back you can carry you know um, your increases your carry weight by five kilograms how much does a bison weigh four kilograms so if I leveled this up yeah let's why not let's level it up and we'll pick up that other bison bison here you go let's go and just pick it up and I'll eat some food too Oops. Oh, you see my skill per day um, actually went down because I'm eating too much of those shoots and things. All right, let's go this way. So yeah, that was worth it to, to pick up that extra bison. All right. There's elk around here somewhere, really? I haven't seen any. Oh, a turkey near me. Okay. We're just going to store these guys inside. Okay, great. This is good. Very good. Now, we can't butcher them yet. We don't have the butchery skill or the table yet. Okay, corn. Corn has carbs. Okay, what does this one have a ton of? It has 6, 3, 11... We need protein. Um, gosh, stomach is full. Okay, can't eat anything else. But I really need something with more, more fat and more protein. What what can we cook with fat and protein in it? Oh wow, we just need fish. Okay, well we're gonna get fish. Fish is gonna come. Uh, can I have I started to build a fishery yet? Let's see. I don't know if I can or not, but we'll look. We have lots of hewn logs. Have we built the fishery yet? I don't think so. Okay, we need fishing one. Do I have to research this or we just have to... Oh, it's just two points. There we go. Okay, let's... Let's build that fishery. Um, and then we need to get up to fishing three to get some traps made. Ah, I do have this. Yay! So we can walk around with a torch, see stuff a little bit better. Um, hmm. Let's go and repair our items because they are costing us in stamina for sure. 
But yeah, I'd like to finish that quest first uh, to get the animals that we need to level up. Okay. Oh, and we had mushrooms. I forgot about the mushrooms. There we go. Could also stand to build some more arrows. So let's make, I don't know, another 25 of these. Actually, no, I don't want to make that many. Let's make 10. I don't want to use up that much wood. Okay. And we'll get out our new fishery. Yay. Get some arrows. All right. So this fishery, I don't know where I can put it. Maybe there. Eh, it doesn't fit there. Unless I rotate it. Oh, it does fit there. How handy is this? Okay. Uh, storage. Oh, actually status. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Look at this. We have exactly the right amount of stuff. Um, <laughs> that's so good. Okay. So, um, the next step probably is to extend, uh, the outside of our building somewhat, um, and move it out. But right now we don't have, we don't have all the materials for that. How's our research going? How are we doing on that? Missing four. It's, we're still missing four of these guys. Okay. Let's figure out what's going on with that. What are you making? You're making sand. You're making pitch. Oh, you're done. Are you done? Okay. So let's make mortared or more. We need to make mortared stone. How come we have so little pitch? Are you making pitch at all? No, not really. You're just slow. They're all so slow with that. Uh, okay. We can make these. Sometimes I don't know why these guys don't move, like get off of here. I don't know if it's because they don't have a place to put it or what, but there's no like, you can't do this kind of thing. I don't know. All right. And after that, we want to do our stone. want to keep on making this stuff. We're going to wait till it finishes here. It doesn't take that long to make the pitch. Okay, there we go. Almost ready. Yeah, the grinding stone to sand just takes forever. And I wish we could put these particular tables outside, these masonry tables. I don't see why it has to be inside at all. Okay, so let's get as many as we can here done. Okay, we'll order these guys. And it looks like we may need to move stone unless we just don't have stone, in which case we'll go mine stone. Oh, we don't even have stone. Yeah, we're just short on stone. We have five stone. All right, let's go mine. Might as well. Let's go down into our mine and go. Okay. So then I want a corridor going. Oh God, it's dark in here. Going this way. Wow, it's dark. What the heck happened to... I need a torch thing. All right, let me grab this thing. Drop the stone in here. Oh my God, it's dark. Okay, so nine, there we go. All right, good. I'm gonna place this torch stand here and put the torch in here for now. Aha, there we go. Um, all right. Probably totally off on my numbers here with you know, how many you can pick up because you can pick up exactly five blocks worth of stone. Okay, I can take one more block right now. But yeah, we'll have a, the stairs will continue to go down this way, uh, but then we're gonna have a corridor to get this stuff going that way. Okay, that's 20. Let's go back up. Place that stuff in. I should probably get another torch 
I'll just put it at the top for when we're doing this stuff here. Now the torches are slightly annoying because they don't stack. Let's get two torches. I think we have another torch stand or did we only make one? I can't quite remember. Let's see. No, I don't see one. All right, we'll have to make another torch stand, which is just fine. I just wanted to check and make sure we're not over making stuff. Road tools, wooden hose. There we go, standing torch. Make one of these, please. Okay, and our torch is done. I'm gonna take this torch with us. And then we'll just grab that. Hopefully this, that takes two minutes. Oh my God. All right, well, we'll come back for that. <laughs> we'll come back for that, not a problem. It'll be fine. Still need to get those darn elk. Okay. But at least we have light down here. That's very useful. All right. So here we want to keep on cutting backward because this is the area we're going to use to store our tailings. Uh, once we start doing our um, stuff, our smelting of iron and copper. In fact, I think I probably should set that up if I don't already. Let's drop off the stone. And you make it at the the other station, this thing. The bloomery. Did I order one? I did order one. Oh, I ordered... Yes, we want to cancel that. We already have one. What's going on here? Ah, I don't have any fuel. Silly me. Yeah, that'll make it work. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I, I think I started that. And uh, yeah, we still have all these, um, these other things, the boards going on. I could cancel the rest of these boards, I guess. How many do we have? Since I canceled, oh, we have 68. I'm going to cancel them. Cancel the boards. Yes, please. Okay, and we have that. It gives us a little bit more lumber. All right, so we're going to make our tailoring table and, and other stuff. I think we need to make some more hewn logs. Um, I'll make 18. Just have a bit of wood left. And we need to go and collect some more wood for stuff. All right, down we go. Yay, mining. All right, cool. There we go. I'm going to turn off that lamp once we Once we're finished with the darkness. Like once night is done, done being night. Okay. Okay, there we go. if we can turn this off and just um, oh there we go just right click on it what oh, is more festive with it on let's turn it on we need electric lighting I have no idea how to get power yet um, but I have seen water wheels and I'm hoping those might generate I don't know if they generate work or power um, we'll have to see once we get there but there are some in the screenshots that look very, very tantalizing. Okay, let's turn this off because I think we're kind of... Nope. Please. Game. There we go. It's like, don't do that, man. <laughs> don't do that. Okay. Um, yeah, we really would like to extend our, our house a bit. 
All right, we're getting hewn logs. We have the, oh, we got a skill book. Great, stone construction. We'll generate a scroll for that. Sounds exciting. We're getting some hewn logs here. Let's go ahead and carry some. All right, oh, and there's more here too. How nice. Okay, great. And there's, oh, we're getting some sand. That's also good. I wanna uh, put down this torch. Oh, and we have our bloomery as well. Oh, all kinds of cool stuff. Okay, oh, there's a bison. Hi, bison. Uh, we'll put that down in a second. I wanna put this torch maybe here. Let's give it fuel, but turn it off. Okay, shall we hunt that bison? Since it's close by, maybe? If it's still here. Oh, I must have scared it off. Okay, we'll, we'll hunt some elk in a second. Uh, but we want to get started with the bloomery. Um, and I think actually putting it over here might be good. Let's see if we can just... The only thing is it needs access to a chest. So maybe out here, because we want the tailings to go in this um, area if possible, but it's not totally necessary. We could put it here. All right, I want you to start working. We need you to make iron ingots like crazy. Do we have skill points to upgrade iron ingotry? <laughs> It's not really a word. Um, 10 points. No, we don't. We need to make basic, basic items in that case. Um, man, everything costs so much to, to do. Very, very expensive. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got advanced campfire stuff. Oh, nice. Campfire stew. I think we're going to need campfire stew for one of the research projects, but I'm not going to get it right now. We did get um, stone construction. Great. Ah, brick construction. Fantastic. We also need bricklaying. That's important. Cement construction and mortared stone construction. Yeah, I want to upgrade this for now. Not quite sure if that refers exactly to the this whole business or not. We'll have to check. Anyway, I think I'd like to extend our house a bit for sure we can have a doorway maybe next to the research table so uh, we'll place enough to make to put down more machines so that's gonna be doorway machine okay machine machine and then here we go. This is how far we want to extend our house, I think, for now. Have another doorway going out the front, too. Good. Okay, great. And we have some windows. Obviously, there's going to be a door there. So we need to have this one. Oh, nice. That works out just perfectly. Okay. Let's keep on building. Actually, we can save the building for nighttime because that that's that will work better then. We still want to do our hunting for elks. So let's go while it's daytime. Elk, elk, elk. I know I've seen some. But can we find them? That's the question. Just walk up here. Okay. Going into the elk zone. But we can hit them from above. Maybe. If we see any. I just don't see any anywhere. There's a wolf down there. Or a... Is it a wolf or a coyote? Something. Oh, 
Oh my god, they run fast. Holy fuzzy cats, they run fast. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to catch it. All right. Oh, yeah. Ooh, you can save an arrow if you just uh, switch to another tool. That's cool. Now then, get our map back up. I don't see any elks around here at all. There's a rabbit or a hare. Oh, there's an elk. Hello. Let's try to get that hare over there. I think I can shoot that far. Oh my God, I can't shoot that far. <laughs> I think that's our three hairs. I think that's our three hairs. Okay, so let's go out here. There's a, I saw an elk. Uh, we'll pick up some of this corn. It's a turkey. There's a rabbit there, or a hare, I should say, not a rabbit. Oh, there we go. Ran across its path. Elk, hello. Where did you go? Cliffs are so high, it's just really kind of funky to try to track animals. Very difficult. Oh yeah, this is this pretty bay. The beautiful view over there, indeed. There's the elk. Okay, we found it. This is a very bad spot, though, to try to kill this thing. Oh, whoops. these. Come on. Yeah, they run fast. They run really fast. Jeez. Not doing very well in hitting the thing, that's for sure. I need it to slow down. Come on. Where did it go now? Oh, jeez. I've lost it. Oh, there it is. There it is. Wow. It is very far ahead. Oopsies. I've gotten the steam overlay on. Uh, let me just eat some food. Maybe that'll help. There it is. Man, it is still running. Let's see if we can take the higher ground. I don't know if that'll help though. Oh no, it's just going that way. Okay. Hopefully it'll slow down one day. I am running. I know it doesn't look like I'm running. I wonder if I'm carrying too much stuff. Don't know if that matters. Okay, just making sure it doesn't go to the other side. Bison, move. Oh, where did it go? Dang it. Oh, there it is. There it is. I'm going to try to get closer before I shoot at it. There we go. A little bit closer. Oh, finally. Okay. Wow, what a chase. <laughs> what a chase. Chasing the dang thing through half the planet. Uh, all right. So let's go to another elk area. <laughs> As if that, that could happen. Let's see. They're supposed to be here. Elk, where are you? There's a turkey. Oh, I need to remove that bison tag, by the way. Let's remove that because we already took the carcass. We did. I could get this bison though. I 
I like bison. They're easy to kill. <laughs> they're big. Easy to hit. Okay, good. Um, still didn't get any elk, though. Well, we got one elk. Yeah, in the last map that I did, uh, elk were quite, quite plentiful. This one, not so much. Okay. Let's drop off the, um, the stuff. So we don't want to carry all of these animals with us as we're going along. There's our elk. Yay! Finally. It's a good thing. Okay, we got some corn. Let's take this corn with us. Corn seeds. And are there any other arrows? Yes, we have some arrows. Great. Ah, yeah, and we can drop off these guys. The property flag claim things. Let's take half... Uh, whoopsies. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Come on, thing. I really would like to... Okay, fine. The UI is just going off the screen there. Okay, we'll take these off in case it matters, like how much weight we're carrying. 0.1 kilograms. That's really not a lot of weight. This is also 0.1 kilograms. <laughs> um, okay, this is our... Our inventory, we're carrying a lot of different stuff right now. We're carrying a cart, is that heavy? 10 kilograms. Yeah, let's take that out and see if we walk a little bit faster or run faster with us. Do we need to carry the deed? Uh, it doesn't matter, I guess. I'm going to put that in my storage box because I really don't need to carry it around. Don't need it. Um, these guys are those. Hammer, one ki these are all like one kilogram each. All right, I wanna see if, oopsies. Is there a better place for elk hunting? Maybe over there. We'd have to swim there though. Let's try though. I think we could try. Okay, can I drop a waypoint here? Probably not, I don't think so. I think you can only drop it when you actually get there. I wish there were, were a way to do that, though. That would be a, a cool, cool thing. If you could just set a waypoint for yourself to say, oh, yeah, I want to go in that direction. Maybe not a waypoint, but like a target marker or something like this. It's interesting that it's still showing the bison thing over here even though I've removed it. <laughs> Unless I left it. No, that's, that still shows the point. It's funky that it didn't update. Okay. Go over to that island. See if we can find some elk. Can't tell if I'm running faster or not. Let's see if I can get that hair. Not quite. Nope, that one didn't even, didn't even think about hitting. Oh, I'm not going to get it now. Okay. How far is it to swim to that place? It's kind of far. Let's see what it's like. Oh, it's not that far, actually. You can see it from here. There's like this kelp in here. I haven't really experienced the under, undersea stuff yet. Don't know if there's a way to harvest stuff, like... With a scythe. I also don't know how to swim downward. I'm gonna have to figure that out. Wow, this is very pretty. Golly. Got some nice mushrooms. This plant is dead? Why? Boy. Okay. Some of them are alive. Alright, so this should be an elk haven. We should not have to chase them very far because this is a small island. Elk, where are you? There's a fox. Okay, let me get out of this map because it takes up so much screen real estate. 
This kind of was annoying me earlier. Lots of these useless bushes. Okay, there's one of those guys. There's a fox. if you could kind of build a trap and like um, get them into a trap. It's cool. We're on top of the waterfall. There's no elk here at all. Here. There's like millions of them. Hmm. Elk, where are you? Hello. Some hairs. Turkey. Interesting. There's no big game at all on this island. Seems like it. Just the small, medium things. There's a hair. Ark. Oh, that should have hit. Mushroom Island. I don't want to try for a fox. They're so fast. Though. Nah. No, it's okay. So tempting, you know? It's so tempting. Got some corn over here. Elk, we need you. I know I'm way outside the zone. But I'm just hoping they might have wandered off this way. Oh, cactus. Wow. Um, let's look at our map. Oh, that's just a, like a cactus island. Oh, it's not even an island. I guess you could chop it. I'm not going to chop it. There's so few of them. Oh, here we go. Might as well grab some kind of game. Come on, we can get this. Okay, there we are. There's another bison. All right, let's see if there are any chances of elk being up here. Not really. <laughs> I have this whole island to look for elk and they should be here, but there's none. I should probably think about going home though. It's nice to be at home in the dark when it is dark. Did I get it? Oh, I did. Oh my god, it went up these cliffs. I had thought they were sheer cliffs, but clearly not. Clearly not. All right, looking for elk. I don't see any. Oops. Uh, oh, and I don't have my torch with me. Darn it. Look how pretty the moon shines through. I love those rays. It's like awesome. Uh, okay. Take out our bow again, just in case we miraculously see an elk, which there are no miraculous elks around here. We already know this. No miraculous elks whatsoever. We did earn 15 skill points, which was nice. Um, we're just going to go back. We're going to go home now. Okay. Leap into the sea. 
Oh, that's cool. The sea has some decent lighting. And we're just going to go home. Where is our workbench? I mean, I know where we are on the map. I just, it's weird that it's not putting it the waypoint in front of us. Surely this is not like halfway across the globe. I hope not. Oh, there we are. There we are. Yay. And do some house building too. Um, actually though, it might have to wait for next episode because we're out of time. Yeah, this elk situation is uh, interesting. <laughs> we may have to go further afield or just wait for them to spawn. Okay. There we go. Workbench incoming. Yay. Okay. First of all, let's turn on the light. Okay, nice. All right, and we will... Get stuff moved along. Oh, well, hello. Oh my goodness, my Araminta just came. How nice. And you know what? I think I didn't set up the iron ingot processing yet, did I? Because I didn't uh, figure out how many I needed. That's unfortunate. All right, let's get food distributed. I would love to have like a quick stack button for chests, like for each individual chest. I think that would be very useful. Say, okay, just quick stack. Everything that's in the chest, we want more of it in the chest. Seeds. Okay. And we're pretty good. We are pretty good indeed. All right, I think that will do us for this episode. Thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.